This video is going to be focused on the benefits of art making. We're going to talk about how making art affects someone's mentality. Um, yeah, so art making is something that's known to help people in many ways. I'm sure you've experienced that drawing, painting, making music, and just creating something makes you feel good. This is due to many factors. It provides time where you can connect with yourself, take a break from thinking about normal day-to-day -day tasks, as well as it allows you to feel in control and feel good about yourself for making something out of nothing. We're going to talk about a lot of these factors um, and how it does affect your brain. In my research, I found a study where um, they they researched like a whole class and they just had a college class about how art making is connect connected to mindfulness. Um, and this is not therapy based or anything. It was just um, to do research and see how that comes about. So in this study, they um, they were asked how might mindfulness practice how might mindfulness practices connect to art education? Um, and it was evident in their art and accompanying reflections that, re re that creating these visualizations give gave them opportunities for reflection and self-awareness. So this class required a semester of daily reflection and mindfulness. Um, and in, in one of the final projects, a student named Maddie painted a painting that she called how can I become more comfortable with being still? So to me, it looks like this painting is a visual representation of how her mind can get away from her and she feels like she doesn't have control of it sometimes. Um, and she was able to put that into a painting, which, um, yeah, it's kind of like, like, a, like a full circle moment with um, the class being about mindfulness that, about the mindfulness practices that go into making art, like drawing lines and physically making art. And then they're producing art that goes back to that same effect. Um, so I thought this was an interesting study and it was found that it did help them actually visualize how they felt um, as well as like realize the physical aspects of making art um, would help them be more mindful as well. Okay, I want to talk about another study on art making as well, the benefits of it. Um, so this study was um, about finding the benefits of art therapy, but there was a control group um, that I'll be focusing on. So the study took another group of college students and it had them use clay for 15 minutes at a time. Um, and one group had uh, mindfulness therapy um, in addition to that and the other one didn't so this other group is called the neutral clay task group um, and they still found that the time spent creating gave them a lot of benefits and they really actually appreciated being in the study um, so students in the control group of neutral clay, neutral clay task found an allowance for flow an ability to refocus and calm down amid stressors, allowance for playfulness and imperfection, increased dedication to self-care, and a desire for more guidance with self-care, including seeking out counseling services. So it allowed them to think about their lives a little bit, um, think about themselves amidst all their college stressors, and um, it left a lot of them questioning, like, well, wanting, like, more help with, like, mental health. Um, so it did help them, but they were still left wanting a little bit more.